it's easy to do something when it's easy to do it. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I start trying to get in shape because I knew it was one of the hardest things to me to do, to complete. And that's my personal goal. I had a personal goal of just losing weight at first. If you haven't, um, hit that like and subscribe button. I am getting cut with Chuck. This is the cut with Chuck. And I just want to motivate people to get towards their fitness goals or get towards their life goals or just get towards their goals they have at the moment. Because everything can be done. I mean, every goal, no matter what it is, not just fitness, can be achieved through hard work, patience, and dedication and determination to get to it. When I first started working out, it was because I wanted to lose weight. It wasn't to be a bodybuilder. It wasn't to be a personal trainer. I didn't really care about what everybody else in the gym was doing around me when I got serious. All I knew when I got serious is that I got to come in here every day and do something towards those goals. I didn't have the ability or the financial ability to hire a personal trainer. And believe it or not, I always wanted a personal trainer. I always wanted somebody to show me how to do what I need to do to see the person in the mirror I wanted to see. And a lot of men, at least, don't put their pride to the side enough to say, hey, I need some help. I need somebody to tell me how to get my belly down or how to get my legs up or how to build a bigger chest. You know what I'm saying? So that's what my job and my business became helping others achieve things they couldn't do by themselves and finding someone like me who's been down the road that they may be traveling to help them get ahead. You know what I'm saying? So that's what getting cut with Chuck is all about, man. It's about achieving something you didn't know you could even do. But once you did it, you know you got to stay committed to it. And that's how you do it. There's no turning back. So when you slack on something you was getting done, it stops getting done. So people ask me, why are you still going to the gym? Because there's still a job to do. So if you feel like you got some results and it's cool to start falling back, that is the wrong way to think. Once you start getting those results you want to see, you know you're right on track to keep on doing that. So repeat that and your body and your results, even even your mind just gets better over time. You know, um, I used to ask people questions about fitness who didn't know much, but they told me what they knew. And the best thing they told me was, you got to keep going. And I'm talking about the ones who did have good gym advice. Because a lot of people in the gym have bad gym advice. So stay away from people with bad gym advice. You know what I'm saying? Especially if they not looking right. You know, how can you listen to somebody about fitness and they not in shape. That's all I got to say. We getting cut with Chuck. Keep it up, baby. Two.